Hey guys, this is XL, and we are back with some more of The Walking Dead. Uh, in the last episode, we learned a, we learned some stuff. We learned that there's a door back in the barn that seems to have something in it. Oh, hi, Danny. How about you and Hello. I have a good chat? Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. What's not to like? It's just a gun. That's where you're wrong. This is Charlotte. She's as faithful as a starving hen when you got a bone in your pocket. Uh. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not he anymore. seems like a high. Of course. He seems Used high to as a kite. School kids on tours back before the dead time. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Poor Sid. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Yeah, he is creepy as fuck. No. I think maybe there, maybe there was like a toolbox or something don't know where though I can't uh, fuck it we're gonna go talk to these fucks up here we'll uh we'll finish talking later you've been getting along with Larry <laughs> he's just a big old sweetheart ain't he oh uh, don't sure. know if I would have used those words exactly uh -huh. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. That is a lesson everyone should learn. Uh, ran into some trouble out there. I'm just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Huh. Before she died. We met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. Of what course. What does that have to do with anything? Means you can't trust them. Any of them. How's Mark doing? What the fuck? Best patient I ever had. Uh, oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. I so, would wait. What are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting. I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. I think I'll go have a look around. Kinda peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters crying against the fence before too long. Yep, most likely. She mentioned the drug thing. And that would make a shit ton of sense with what's his face over there. Oh, hey. Hope Mark is okay in there. Yeah, we have not been able to go into the house. Oh, hey. Toolbox. Huzzah! Okay, what? Ooh. A multi tool. That should be handy. Oh, so that's what those tools are called. I always call them like. I always call them like camping pliers because they had like everything in them. At least that's what my dad called them. Excuse me. Use the fence. Oh, hey, it stopped raining. Well, it stopped raining outside my window, but it's still raining in the game, it sounds like. The way he jumps like that makes me feel like there's like a monster or something. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Oh, hey, I can look at these now.
Nope, nothing in this one. What's in this one? Oh, I went to the far away one by accident, whoops. What the fuck? Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Okay, that is not normal farm equipment. I shit you not. What the? Pork food. It's a feeding trough. Alright, that's weird. So we did something with that generator. Let's see if we can use this multi tool on it. Because uh, in the last episode, we turned off the generator and got him out here. The thing that really is bugging me about what we're going to do is it's going to turn off the fence. And it's starting to get dark. Can I... Andy knows how to fix this if something goes wrong. I'm clueless about this stuff. Can't I use the multi tool on this? I'm glad Andy knows how to fix this if something goes wrong. I'm clueless about this stuff. Uh. Do I just turn it off? What do I do? What do I do? Oh, there we go. I'm stupid. I missed it. Clicky. Hey, I said multi tool. There you go. Looks like that film's driving the, uh, what you call it? Damn it! Thing is moving fast. Ow! Damn it! Thing is moving fast. Okay, guess I turn this off for a second. Then I... <clears throat> that thing is on too tight for my bare hands. Okay. There, that should do. I didn't close the thingy though. Damn, thirty miners piece of shit. Oh, fucking thing through a bell. Damn it all. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this will take forever. Okay. Can I Okay, I can't talk to him. Seriously, when I first turned it off, he he came out right away. But when I turned it off this time, he took forever. So this is really weird. Uh, hi, hi, Kenny. I picked up something I think could help with the lock. Nothing to stop you now. Uh, I'm scared. Seriously? Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. This is scary. Oh, I feel like there's a zombie or something. There has to be a zombie. I'm so scared. Why? Why am I putting my hand? Oh, I'm just holding it so, but I'm not even holding the screws. Like, what the fuck? Uh. 
Oh, Jesus. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. They're eating the zo- Oh, 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 Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Excuse a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mom? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. No. I wash my hands first. Bathroom's right outside in the hall. No. Sure no, 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 no. You've no. been mucking around in the dirt all day. We're going to eat Mark, aren't we? Gauze pants. No, I don't want to close the medicine cabinet. I want to open the medicine cabinet and examine everything inside of it. Some kind of lotion. I could use a shave. My mouth sensitivity is now too high. I'm so scared right now. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. I'm seriously like terrified. What do I need so much morphine for? Candles. Smart. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Musty as hell. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Huh, where is that cord going? I don't know. I'm scared. The cord is... the cord isn't going anywhere. Can I open other doors or is... no, that's the only door. Mark? Is that blood? Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Mark? Farm books, cookbooks... Nothing out of the ordinary here. Mark. Feels like there's a storm coming. I'm going to throw up, aren't I? Can I push it? Is that blood? What do I do? Do I? Huh, what is that cord going? Do I? Oh, okay. 
Use power cord. Oh my god, please don't electrify him. What the hell? I'm scared. I am literally terrified right now. <laughs> oh, Mark. Oh god, Mark. Oh my god. I am li I'm going to throw up, aren't I? Sorry guys, I almost threw up. Spit that out! Lee, what's going on? Lee, Jesus man, did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a stall. He could use some goddamn manners. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. What the hell? Dang. You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? They're picking us off to trade as meat. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. Brenda, tell me he's not being eaten right now. I... It's true. <laughs> Everything could have turned out okay for you <laughs> folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. I'm okay. Growing up in Sorry, Georgia, guys. You're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I'm I okay, raised guys. my boss. Sorry about now, that. you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. He wasn't going to die, though. Like y'all. Lily, grab a knife! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. Damn it. What the fuck? The fucking whack! Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't wanna die. What the fuck? Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. What the fuck? Lee? Lee? Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Oh my god. What are we doing? Mark, please, please don't let that be Mark. Oh my god. Please run. Please, please just please. run. Uh, someone. Oh my god. Oh my god. Open the goddamn door! That's an achievement! I will tear you oh, I'm gonna throw up. You gotta find another way out of here. Oh my god, I'm gonna throw up. I'll be right back, guys. Open this door, god damn it! I will knock the Please, goddamn Dad, door stop. down! It, it was a person. I ate meat from a person. Does that mean I'm gonna turn into. I'm okay. I'm back. I'm okay. 
doesn't work like that. If he would have stopped us in time. Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. I tried. What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. Let us out, you sons <sighs> of bitches. Oh my god. Dad. This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. Okay, gonna find I was way trying to help you people. How was I supposed to know that they were eating people? I assumed they were eating zombies. Meat. Yeah. Don't wanna know what kind. Please settle down. I'll rip your goddamn heads up. Like for fuck's sake. pretty sturdy. We could climb up. There's no way out through the ceiling. Come on. Oh my god. Could there be a hole behind these pallets? I hope so. Please. No such luck. God damn it. There's more of us on the way. Let us out now. If you Don't give live. up. We're gonna Not find a way help. out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Oh my god. They're not gonna open the door! You, you think a fucking apocalypse gives you the right to chop Salt people mix. into meat? Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. Dad, this isn't helping! No, Your dad's it's not, not helping. making things any easier for us. Open the fucking Dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, Easy. Dad? No. No. Dad, come on. Dad! No. God, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead. Dead. You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. I, I... In a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you. We can bring him back. Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny. He is not dead. I... Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. I... That man is dead. You both is know this... what happens next. Oh my God, is this the point Look, where I have Kenny, to pick between the Kenny? When we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not going to make oh it. Oh my God. Remember what Ben said. Got to destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. I. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. I. Come on, Dad. I. Come on. I. Wake up. I have to. Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay. Let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. I. I. Oh, no. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn. You're putting all of us what? at risk, you son of a bitch. You're freaking worthless, Lee. No! No! What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. No. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! I... No, Clementine. Oh, come on! Okay. Really? More He's achievements? More fucking achievements? Yes, for now. We still need to find a way out of here. Why is that an achievement? I know, I know. But you gotta be strong right now. Oh, why is that an strong. achievement? That should not Think be an achievement. something else, something hopeful. Like what? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? We found a way out? Very I'm soon. Working on it. I... Oh, sorry, Lily. 
I tried. I. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. I'm sorry, Lily. I truly am. Larry and me, we might not have got along so great, but I know he would have done anything to protect you. He was a good father. <laughs> Hug her. Hug her or something, you son of a bitch. I don't I don't know what we do I know now. It's necessary. But I just wish Clint didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. It's gonna make her a strong fucking person, that's what. I don't wanna hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we wanna survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. One of us? I'm the one who ch You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Dust? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have- No! They, they need Katja, remember? She's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta oh get my to God. That's all. I want to figure out How, what do we do now? I I don't know what we do now. I really don't. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to All right, I don't know what we're supposed to do. So, uh, oh wait. There ought to be eh? an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Yes, good thing of we have the multi-tool. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, uh, rock won't help. You have a coin? Mm -mm. Larry has money. If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. Larry has a coin. It's not coming off that way. I'm sorry. How do we get the coins from Larry? Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Uh, what? Look, if we're gonna survive this shit, we've got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. You bastard. Fuck I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time, but Back at the motor inn. Larry. Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. This is horrible. I feel so bad. The oh, feels, boy. man. The feels. Any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Uh, it's most likely the chest pocket. I don't want to search the back pocket. A ring. My mother's. Don't worry. I'm not taking it. At least we're learning more about him. Here we go. Oh, was it? And a dime. 61 cents. I kind of wish I knew it was in this back pocket. 
uh, we're gonna end the episode off here. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying this. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye! Poof!